What is going on guys and welcome to episode 9 of Ronaldo and Bale's Road to Ultimate Domination. If you're looking to buy FIFA Ultimate Team Coins guys, check out the FIFA shop. Their link is in the description below and you can use my discount code uh, LJ92 for 10% off. But yeah guys, um, I apologise this video is normally out around 3 o'clock. I normally get a video out for about 3pm GMT. Um, it's out at 4 o'clock. Um, I just had a few things to do so I didn't get around to actually doing it. As well guys, I apologise if I've got a bit of a lisp or I like splurp some words or something like that. Um, I had football match last night, that's why a video wasn't out yesterday. And I got an elbow to the face and I've cut all my lip up so I'm finding it a little bit hard to talk actually to drink and to eat. So that's probably why I'm a bit like slurpy. But I wanted to actually get a video out for you guys because I haven't brought a video out since uh, Wednesday. So I didn't have one out yesterday. As I said, I had a football match. But as you can see in the background, guys, a few things I've actually sold uh, of the bronze BPL players that we picked up. And we go and pick ourselves up a Carl Walker for 1,600 coins to strengthen up our defence. And putting Carl Walker in there gives uh, Jack Wilshere the 9 chemistry now, which we want. So we've got 9 chemistry on Walker and... Uh, Bale, uh, Lennon, and we've got Jack Wilshire on 9 chemistry as well now, so we're on to getting well, we've got 100% chemistry, but I think, I don't know what really players that are on 9 chemistry, I think Ronaldo's still on 7, but we're going to go and jump into a game guys, but I'm not going to talk about anything uh, about what's going on in the background in this episode guys, apologise this video is actually only about 5 minutes long, but I'm pretty glad it's not too long because I don't think I'll be able to talk for about 10 minutes long because of my mouth, uh, but yeah, I want to talk about club rivalries so basically you've got the Manchester derby Man United and Man City you've got Liverpool and Man United you've got Arsenal and Tottenham which is the North London derby you've got the El Clasico Barcelona and Real Madrid at the moment like Bayern Munich and Borussia Dortmund are quite a big rivalry so we've got like, all these different rivalries and I just want to ask you guys the question of the day for this video is what do you think the biggest rivalry is do you think it's the El Clasico do you think it's the Manchester derby do you think it's Manchester United Liverpool in my opinion being a Man United fan I think it is Manchester United and Liverpool. Even though the Manchester derby is very big and over the past couple of years it's become even bigger because Man City are challenging for the title and so are Man United. But I still think Man United and Liverpool are the biggest rivalry because they've been around since God knows how long. And they're just two of the most successful clubs in English football and they've always had a big rivalry. And they're the two clubs that I think have got the biggest rivalry in the world. Then probably coming up, Barcelona, Real Madrid, that seems to be a very big rivalry as well. So that's the question of the day, guys, is what do you think the biggest rivalry in football is between two clubs? West Ham and Millwall have always got a big rivalry, but that's more like fighting. That's not about football. But what do you think is the biggest rivalry? Maybe you sport, I don't know, Southampton, and then you've got a rivalry with somebody. You might think that's the biggest rivalry. That's completely up to you guys. It's all opinionated, depending on what team you support. So it's just good if you drop in the comments below and let me know. What, it, what who your club is and maybe the, who their biggest rivalry is or what do you think the biggest rivalry is. So mine is thinking Man United and Liverpool or Man United and Man City. I'd say more edging it Man United and Liverpool. Uh, but yeah guys, that is the question of the day. So if you could drop that in the comments below, that would be absolutely awesome. But as you can see in the background, I think we did actually pick up two wins there. A uh, 4-1 win or maybe it was only one game. I'm not really sure, I wasn't even concentrating, but we picked ourselves up three points and we were up to nine points in this division without losing so far. And then we come up against this guy here, didn't have great chemistry, 84 rated, very, very solid team, Pepe, Di Maria, Chiellini, uh, Dava Luiz, Robinho, Mario Gozzo, Pirlo, Suarez, Cavani and Balotelli and Buffon in the net. Mancini as manager, it was a very, very strong team and this guy, this is literally all that happened, Balotelli in the 29th minute, bangs it in to make it 1-0 in the 30th minute. And that is how the game actually does end, guys. This guy was an absolute knob. He ended up passing it around the back for absolutely ages. I think for like to the 70th minute and then I got a few attack. But that was about it. But yeah, guys, it is actually coming to the episode. I do apologise that it is a short episode. If we can get this video over 100 likes, that would be very much appreciated. If you'd leave a like on the video, it really does mean a lot. And I really do appreciate it. And it really does actually help out my channel. Uh, as well, remember to drop in the comments below the question of the day. What do you think is the biggest rivalry in football and nowadays between two clubs? Remember to leave a like on the video. And if you actually are new around here, remember to hit that subscribe button as well. I think we're coming up to 3.9k subscribers, which is absolutely insane. So please remember to like the video, comment in the comment section below and subscribe if you actually are new around here. So thank you for watching, guys. Take care and I will see you all soon. Cheers.